hey guys welcome to my new tutorial in this particular tutorial I'm going to teach you how to switch on and switch off conditional formatting you switch on conditional formatting and then you switch off conditional formatting with the click of a button now this is basically going to help you whenever you have any dashboards that you want to uh, present to your uh, team and this is going to be really helpful when you have this kind of button to switch on and switch off the conditional formatting let's take a look at how we build this all right so uh, i have a sample data set here and i have already applied a conditional formatting to say uh, let me teach you uh, let me take you through that once again let me delete all of this okay uh, so you go to conditional formatting highlight cell rules which is greater than 10 sorry 10 okay okay i think i did not apply them to all of the rows let me apply them to all of them click on apply okay now you have the cells highlighted anything which is greater than 10 now how do you uh, add the on and off button for this uh, you will have to go to the developer tab in case you don't have the developer tab enabled go to file options customize ribbon click on uh, main tabs and then you have the developer tab just click on add and say ok uh, it, the developer tab will get enabled since I have the developer tab already enabled here I am going to insert a form control button in this case I'll take this checkbox and I'll add it here okay and I'm just going to give a color to it let's say this particular green and rename this checkbox one to read as conditional formatting on off on or off okay now I'm going to link this particular checkbox to D1 you say okay uh, let's have this over D1 all right and you go back to your selection where you want to apply the conditional formatting Cl go to new rule click on use a formula to determine which cells to format and then type in not open bracket d1 this is the same cell which we had referred to in the format control close the bracket say ok go back to conditional formatting manage rules and click this stop if true click on apply ok now the moment you hit that you see that this has disappeared because we have not checked the box the moment you check the box here you will have the conditional formatting working again you click this on again the conditional formatting disappears now what's happening in the background is uh, when you uncheck the form control here this is changing to false and when you check this it changes to true that is what working in, is working in the background to help our conditional formatting on and off button i hope you have enjoyed the video and i hope this will help you somewhere in making the dashboards more better hope you have enjoyed the video and hit the like and subscribe button uh, if this has helped you ever and do let me know in the comment section if you want me to make any particular video where you are stuck with thanks for watching